Hey guys, welcome to another session of Epic 7, where Professor Jagan brings you guys into another science class. So for those who are watching on YouTube, and not, you know, you don't come, come to my live streams, you might not know what the science class is. Again, this is a running series, kind of like a meme series, where we do random stuff, generally like analyzing art, waifu, and stuff like that. Uh, for this one, because DN is just around the corner, Christmas is here, so I'm gonna give you guys an early Christmas present. DN is here, and <laughs> people people may be wondering like, hey, should I be pulling for her? Uh, I'll be doing an, a, a, an additional video, like separate from this one, talking about like DN and her actual usefulness, PvP, uh, and maybe even PvE showcases. Uh, but for this one, uh, for those who started the game like when DN was first released or even like straight after uh, on Reddit, it was pretty popular that people figured out that DN's S3 has a broken skill. And what I mean by that is, and I should put a disclaimer right here, if you are, if you are a parent and you're watching this with your kids, don't <laughs> turn it off right now. Um, in terms of like, it's, it's, I mean, it's not like like rated r or whatever but the topic we're going into is definitely adultish. so i would say um if you want to keep your mind pure um definitely stay away from this video so viewer discussion is advised i was joking that uh <laughs> i'm i'm a, i am a parent oh man never mind um <laughs> sorry i was reading the stream chat anyways uh yeah we're gonna go through this so it's a bit embarrassing for me but basically what what's going to happen is uh we're gonna do some recordings here and you guys won't be able to see what's happening until we go to part two of the video uh what i mean by part two is i'm gonna bring in um uh like all the video recording that we're recording right now into our editing software so it's gonna be kind of like an inception like filmception is that even a word? Anyways, it's gonna be a video within a video, potentially within another video, but I don't think it needs to go through the, the third phase. We don't need to go deeper in that sense. We're gonna go to this one. Uh, well, it doesn't matter. Actually, it doesn't matter because I'm gonna be yielding anyways. So basically what we're gonna do is we're capturing footage, okay? So the first part, we're capturing footage, and it'll look like nothing because I, I'm telling you right now, unless your eyes are trained to be run at like one frame per second you're not going to catch the glitch so basically what happens is on dn's s3 when she does her s3 everyone on the on your on your team goes semi semi naked in terms of and i'll explain i'll explain it the reason but anyways it was a split second it already happened um so you won't be able to see it with your naked eye no puns intended no puns intended i am uh okay so we captured that jk say luna you fiend so i'm talking to you guys on stream as well do you guys want to uh <laughs> do you guys want to give me more suggestions on waifu uh someone someone actually mentioned uh tamarine both forms that's an interesting request i've never gotten that request before but we could i guess so i'm gonna run a syria on it because that way we can like do the what is it called the transformation right away so tamarine both forms okay so yeah i gotta stop my party yo yo man welcome to stream dude do crowd do set nah i think okay fine if you guys want if you want want uh want males to sure they're just gonna look like ken dolls though ken doll ken dolls okay no no <laughs> Uh, okay, so Tamarine, both forms. I do need an Assyria on this one. Um, Assyria is Earth. So it's right here. Uh, anyone else for this run? A Ravi? Apocalypse Ravi. Man, what do you guys want? Lollies? Hold on, let me see. Let me see. Someone said do Charles. Oh my goodness. Oh, let's, let's do the let's do the waifus first. So someone said uh a robbie so s4 you get that so let's go a robbie but i don't think we're gonna see much to be honest it, it's more it's more obvious with with the uh, <clears throat> with uh girls with curves but uh oh this this speed throttling is gonna be weird i might have to do two two times here uh for tamarine because tamarine goes first before my dn so i might have to yeah so let's let's just go into a hunt it doesn't matter just go something quicker Kisei Raviyuna. Kisei Raviyuna. K 
Key say cigarette unit? Oh, okay. Team glasses. Kisei doesn't have glasses. Okay, that's not the right one. Uh, what did I do? Is my fodder team? No, my raid team. Yeah, you want to see that frog? Let's see that frog naked. Okay, no. All round of Wanda. Sadly, uh, Shiaith, I don't have her uh SD yet. I'm 500 hunt materials away. As you command. Uh, alright, maybe maybe let's do Tamarine's idol form first. Blue. Okay, so I just have to remember this on the recording. Tamarine's idol form first. I, I think I'm going to faint. Do my song. Uh, Dree Canyon. No, you're welcome, man. You're welcome. Okay, I'm just gonna push up uh DN so we get the turn. Actually, it doesn't matter. That's a waste of time. Okay, here we go. So that's the recording there. That's already done. It's already done. Super fast. Hey, Sour Pie, welcome. Oh my goodness, I I feel so embarrassed because this is gonna be hilarious. All right, so I'm gonna go again. Uh, we may as well swap one set of heroes here because we already saw the Tamarine, uh, one on the idol form. So I don't need a Syria now. Um, so we can swap this, swap this one out. Uh, anything else? Lilius? Oh, oh, uh, ah, uh, Lilius? Ooh. Mm, okay, all right. Oh wait, wait, wait. No, no. Someone, someone said uh, cigarette. Cigarette is actually cigarette. We probably won't see much. That's the problem. I, I'll explain why some don't work. But let's go cigarette and Lilius, and then maybe we'll bring an ice key. Say, but some won't really work. Actually, I don't think tamarine will work either. Um, based on how it is. But you guys will see what I mean. So we captured a couple ones that um, Cirilla would work. Cirilla would work. Um. Yeah, so you guys will see. You guys will see the how how it works. It it doesn't work exactly the way you think. Um, yes, yeah, sour pie. This is what we're doing, man. <laughs> Feels bad. Hey, yo, Turushi, welcome. Okay, and now Dian's gonna do this. So everybody's gonna go into the. All right, we already got it. So I don't need to. I probably don't even to run the entire animation because that's a waste of time. So I can yield it even before she finishes it. Oh, but even if you press the yield, it will just finish the animation. Never mind. I forgot. That's how it works. Uh, okay, and uh, I think Cirilla would work. So basically, it would be like uh, it has to be like a waifu character that pretty much already has no clothes on, which is pretty weird. Let's see. Does Melissa work? Let me see. Meli no, nah, she doesn't really work. Um, Corinne, Corinne in. Uh, her skin form might work though. So let me swap. Why is my Karin not in skin? That's weird. Karin in skin form may work. Um, wait, did I apply it? No, I didn't apply it. Uh, SSB won't work. She has a fan, so that won't work. So I'm gonna apply this. Equip. And uh, let's see. Yeah, some of current abs. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. And then, uh, does Dizzy work? Dizzy... Maybe. Um, and then we're saying Cirilla. Cirilla should work. And I think that's that's pretty much it. Um, I don't know. Like, BBK... No, nah, the BBK won't work. Uh, let's see. Let me see. Kise, Kise shouldn't work. No, Kise I don't think works. I don't know, maybe key someone said Yuna too. Okay, maybe we'll run another one. Vivian might work. I'm gonna run Cirilla on this one, and then I think that's good for this round. And then maybe just one more round. We don't need to go like extensively to every single character. I don't think it's necessary. But Cirilla should work. Based on her. Yeah, Cirilla should work. Yep. Okay, so check this out. Mercedes. Mercedes I don't think works either. So Okay, so let me let me go back into the hunt, record it. Biken might work. Well, I have to see. I actually haven't seen anyone else except Luna in the past, because back when um, the redditors were finding this out, uh, they used DN and Luna. I don't think they use anyone that also I'm familiar with. But anyways, that's that's already happened. Just right there. Is I'm I'm wondering I'm wondering though. Oh, actually, no, you can yield it. Post uh in animation. That's good. Okay, so let me go and uh, 
swap out now. There's too many now I think about it. There's too many that could potentially be a part of the science class. So we have, uh, I think Yuna will work. So I'm going to go down the list. Falcon O'Cleary might work too. Because, yeah, I think Falcon O'Cleary could work. Biken. Biken might work. Uh... Did notice that the notice that I have a serious tone. I think Commander Lorena even works too, but we're gonna go for Yuna first. I think. Let's try Yuna, but actually I don't think Yuna would work. Now, now that I think about it, Yuna won't work. She has a she has a cell phone there, so like, it's gonna be it's gonna be ML Silk. ML Silk would work, I think. Okay, let me let me go run this this team. <laughs> muscle memory i just like reflex i just put it on the imprint swap characters around uh regular larina would work better than commander would it i don't remember what regular larina looks like now she has what regular arena has less clothes i didn't know that Were you waiting? Oh, really? Oh, that's interesting. Okay, I don't know if I have a Lorena laying around. I think I imprinted my last one, so I don't think uh, that will work. Okay, so yield. Okay. And then uh, let's go back. And okay, so let's swap out one more. So there's a lot of footage that we have to cover. This is a huge science class, man. Probably the most scientific science class that we've ever run. F Maya. Does anyone want to see Choco Maya? No, she won't. She won't work. I know she won't. Uh, we'll try Commander Lorena. Um, I don't think... I really don't think I have another one. I think I tripled S her. Uh, Vivian, I think, would work. Vivian might work. And then I'll choose one more, and then that's it. Rose? Maybe Ice Rose? Someone said Wanderer Silk, right? So I said, well... Rose might work, but I think Wanderer Silk might work better. So let me check one sec. Yeah, I also have to look at their pose. Their pose actually can uh, can affect the the glitch. All right, Wanderer Silk is way crazier. <laughs> Wanderer Silk is way crazier. <laughs> Rin, Rin is cra okay. Oh, there's too many. Okay, maybe run one more after this. <laughs> I think there's too many. There's too many. Um, both silks, both silks would pretty much be the same. I think they're they have the exact same like. Like model, it's just that they're they're tinted different. One's chocolate, one's one's white chocolate. That's it. All right, <laughs> so I'm gonna get so many. I'm gonna be demonetized, man. No, oh man, guys, guys must must support must support Jay again. This is the content you guys are are here for, right? This is this is the content. Okay, that's done. Yield. Yeah, this is end game content. This is this is end game content. <laughs> uh. Uh, didn't do Sermia A. Kali. I can have some peace of mind. No, Sermia and A. Kali, there, there's nothing there. There's nothing there. Um, okay, and then the last one, like we said, we said, um, uh, maybe Rose. Someone said regular Silk. Was there another one? Like, Gloomy Rain is actually, like, pretty. No, no, she's covering. That won't work. Celestial Mercedes? Uh, Celeste Mercedes might work. I think that's it. I think that's it. So this might be our last one. Yeah, I don't think there's any other... Oh, someone said Rin. Okay, I'm just gonna do one more. I'm gonna remove regular silk, because it's gonna be the same as Choco silk. But I don't think Rin will work. Okay, let me go. <laughs> oh, did you do Crow yet? No, we haven't done the... Let's actually, let's do a... Let's do one round of guys as well. Just to show you... I can show you the, the Ken doll thing. But I will use Ken in that actual experience. But you guys choose the other ones. You guys want Crow? Okay, one, one, one wants Crow. The other one, I'll, uh, the last one. I only do one. Let's advance together. Uh, I think someone mentioned Says, but Says is already in like uh the swim suit. He has the he has the he has the summer skin. So you already know what he kind of looks like anyway. So it doesn't really matter. Let's go and set Violet. Uh, all right, I'll take it. I'll take it. I think Violet's a very different one. 
Uh, Ken Crow Crow. I doubt. I really doubt you'll see anything. He's in too much armor, man. His armor's too thick. Violet Vildred. Okay, we got a lot. I'm gonna go Violet. I'm gonna go Violet just because I think Violet is cool. Nah, you won't see much. You won't see much. It's okay. But you guys will see what I mean. And this is a good enough example uh, to see what's actually happening. So I'm gonna go with this. One. Lena. Someone said Lena. Uh, no, no. I don't, I didn't even want to do that for the waifu portion, man. What? What is she, what is what is Lena considered a waifu or <laughs> or what? <laughs> no, <laughs> no. Oh! Someone said no, man. No, dude. No. Someone said Aether. Definitely Aether. No, screw you, man. Screw you. No, I'm never. I'm never gonna do that, man. That's just. Dude, that's just wrong. On 20, 20 different levels. That's just completely wrong. Okay, so we've captured, I think, everything we need. So I'm going to stop this portion, and we're going to jump straight into the After Effects. Alright, so now we're in After Effects. We have the video uh, here. So we can check. Uh, now what you guys will see is uh, there's only going to be about, uh, about 3 frames or so of DN actually, her S3 actually setting off this glitch. So basically what's happening is the the game is trying to go into a transparency or trying to fade out the characters. But the thing is, here, see, see, see it happens so fast that it's almost unnoticeable. So right now I'm uh, I'm going frame by frame. Okay, I'm going to try to try to do this as best I can. It's pretty hard to to nail down because the the frame is so limited. So as soon as the S3 starts, which is about now, okay, you can see that um What's happening is uh, the characters are actually going transparent because they're trying to fade it out. But basically, as they're fading it out, the clothes are disappearing. So you guys can see that. The Luna one is probably the biggest, like the most obvious one because I think it's just how they skinned Luna. So it's pretty crazy. So <laughs> people on stream was just like, oh, like, like nice lol okay so yes you guys can see it like obviously they're, they're not meant to be like fully like naked that's why a lot of the characters we chose i'm like oh it, it doesn't work but basically you can see how they built this i mean science scientifically speaking how they built this is simple um these are not just 2d renders they're 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 like 3d they have skins therefore it's easy for the developers to actually swap skins because they just need to make new pieces on top so they're separate. As soon as they go transparent, what's happening is that each layer is going transparent with it. So like, the, depending on the frame. So look, look, look. We're going in, right? But Luna there, I mean, there's there's a lot of, of course, I mean, we have to be like pervy enough to kind of do the guesswork, but pretty much, you guys know what I mean. So you fiends doesn't really work and Kisei's doesn't really work either. Luna, I've seen so far the most success. Going into this video recording, I don't even, I never even, like, like I said, I, I'm not pervy enough to, like, test it on every single waifu. <laughs> so, this is, like, live science class. Like, this is, like, live reveal for me. I think Luna's the most obvious one. Um, everyone else, I'm not quite sure of. So, anyways, this is captured now on video. You guys see this frame by frame. I will save this one. Uh, as its own like frame as we work on the the other ones actually hold on I'll, I'll, I'll save it down like maybe maybe there I think um, it's also because I think it also because the it's it's kind of like mysterious so your mind kind of fills in the blanks so to speak so another another science thing so yeah it's a hu it's the human mind once they see something like let's say let's say they see something that's close to a face but it's not really a face, our mind automatically fills in. That's just the just the miracle of the brain. So it's not really it's not really like we are actually seeing them closeless, but our minds are actually filling in what's happening. So anyways. And as the as the animation progressed, the transparency made it even more kind of convincing because you know we we think in our mind as as things go transparent, you're gonna see things underneath. Even though the, the body of Luna and the other heroes on the screen were actually disappearing at the same rate as the clothing, our minds still played that game. So it just, you know, get your head out of the gutter, get your head out of the gutter. 
This is all for science? Yes, this is all for science. This is all for science. Um, <laughs> we see the miracle of the perv brain? Yes, 100%. Uh, so I'm still clipping the video. Sorry that's off crop because I just realized that every every single thing is going to be like useful on this side. So someone, someone suggested uh, like in uh, the beginning, they wanted to see Tamarine and Assyria which or sorry tamarine mainly but in both forms so i'm already going on a limb here just knowing how this kind of what did i skip it oh no no i'm just finding my team um uh, i know that uh i know that this won't work um uh, as you guys saw there if the transparency like if the if the character didn't already have assets kind of popping out of clothes um if there's cl fully clothed like covering it there's it's not gonna work so i think first things first i did the s3 reset the cooldown we did the idle form, and then I did that foolishly. Okay, and then now the S3. Okay, here we go. So let's see what this looks like. So I have no idea. This is a few, uh, like full, full, full new reveal for me. I'm going down. Okay, so here we go. So yeah, so that doesn't look that great. Doesn't look that great. So no, this this does not pass the this does not pass the perv test. Um, they are disappearing with their clothes. So yeah, I think I think only like Luna sort of works. I think Cirilla will work. Um, I thought Euphine was working. Rewind a frame or two. Oh, okay, hold on. Ravi, Ravi. Ah, uh, you know what? I think Fire Ravi is more obvious. Actually, I remember one of the one of the pervs on Reddit. <laughs> One of the pros I read, I think, did uh, Fire Robbie. Like, Fire Robbie was actually very obvious. She wasn't wearing anything. It's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy. Um, okay, so that one is this one. So we'll, we'll keep we'll keep this we'll keep that frame there. So I'll, I'll split the I'll split the clip here. Uh, I'll keep these. Um, so in case we need to refer back to them for whatever reason, uh, and then we're skipping that one. We're going to the next team. Let's go quick. And then someone wanted to see Tamarine not in idle form. And yeah, Cigarette Lilius will not work. This will not work. They're fully clothed. So yeah, so my science, scientific theory. We're seeing this unravel, ladies and gentlemen. And yes, there are ladies. Or maybe at least one lady in this stream. So this is not super biased. And she's watching it because it has entertainment value as well. Wait, 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 wait. wait. We already passed it. We already passed it. Wait, wait, wait. One second, one second. We're going to go back a bit. Okay, so it's just about here. Okay, so I'm gonna clip this here so it's easier to find. Yes, I'm using her as a shield. I am using her as a shield. I will admit, but hey, hey, we gotta, we gotta make sure that uh, you know, there's diversity, right? Diversity. Okay, so here we go. There you go. So not much happening. Not much happening. Tamarine, you can see that her head model and her hair model are splitting. That's kind of interesting there too. Cause actually I never noticed that. I never noticed that before. Uh, but yes, nothing's happening on this one. Nothing's happening on this one. Okay. Okay. So we'll we'll split the clip, uh, and then we'll go on again finding new new ones. Skip that one. We fast forward, fast forward, fast forward. Okay, and then we find a new team. And I, I said Melissa, and I don't think Melissa will work either. You guys can begin to see the trend now. I here I swap in the Summer Skin Corinne. I think Summer Skin Corinne can work. Um, her position on the on the field and the the skin. No, it won't work. It won't work. It's not Luna. Luna's Luna's pretty much already ninety nine percent naked. So it's uh that that one that one was a that one's like a freebie. <laughs> Cancer Tamarine, she has to wear fake hair. Yeah, feels bad, man. She's going through the chemo. Not sorry, we shouldn't joke about that, guys. We shouldn't joke about that. That's 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 distasteful. Distasteful. All right, so what do I do here? All right, we put it. Oh yeah, I tried Ice Kise, and I'm thinking no, that won't work. So I swap her out right, right, right away. Oh, I'm still choosing my character. Holy crap, this takes a long time. Cirilla, right, right, right. We go Cirilla. Cirilla should somewhat work. So we're gonna go now into the fight with this team. Yeah, so let's go and uh, enter the fight. 
Okay, that was a long one. Okay, so we're going, 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 going. And right, Deanne is ready to do her S3. Yeah, here we go. So I'm selecting it now. So, okay, okay, okay. Here we go. This is it. Let's see. Cirilla. Cirilla's kind of works. Dizzy doesn't and Corinne doesn't. Cirilla, Cirilla sort of works, but I think Luna's positioning still makes it more obvious. Uh, Cirilla's cape disappears. You can see the curves. Um, your mind is filling in the blanks, but I think Luna is still the, num the number one there. Can you go back about one to two frames for Dizzy? One to two frames? Like, okay, maybe this stream delay. So I'm going to go through every frame. Okay, so for Dizzy, yeah, Dizzy won't work. Dizzy doesn't work. It's like maybe maybe there. That's probably that's the probably the best one right there. Yeah, Cirilla looks like she still has a bra. Yep, yep. I I do agree. I do agree. Um Yeah, Dizzy Dizzy doesn't work. Okay, so we're clipping this part um and then on to the next one. Next team. Okay, here we go. Uh, move that over. Man, we're so we're so pervy, man. Just re <laughs> just realizing how how to see. But this is science class. This is science class. We've I think we've done worse, right? I think we've done worse. Falcon Cleary, right? Falcon Cleary. Uh, which I tried Command Lorena, but I don't think it worked. Right, I tried Yuna, that didn't work. Biken. Okay, so that's that's yeah. We tried Yuna, but Yuna won't work. That's weird. I don't know why I still ran with Yuna. I already know it won't work. But I guess for science, we need to find out uh, if this works or not. This would be interesting. Okay, here we go. Oh yeah, Yuna goes first, right? So here goes the buff. Boom. Uh, now DN is gonna go. Okay, so I select the S3 here. Okay, so we're gonna clip here and then we're gonna go investigating. Okay, here we go. This is it. Yep, you know won't work. Clurry, nah, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. You can see it. You can see it. So only only Luna technically works like the best right now. Even though I have to say though, Biken is weird. Biken's head disappears first, but then her chest remains. Do you guys see that? Like what the what the heck? <laughs> that's so that's so weird, man. That's so weird. It's like <laughs> chest greater than head. Yeah, she she disappears, but her chest remains on the screen like at least like one frame longer. But yes, they don't work. Okay, so we'll clip it at uh, about this frame here. And uh, so the Luna part was the only part that really worked. Okay, so let's go. Skip. Who else did we do? And then of course, then the the Ken doll guys will not work. They have too much clothing on. Now F my won't work. I know that. Oh, we did use the Seal Arena. Okay. And Vivian, that won't work. That won't work. We already know it. We already know it. So science class, science class is done. Like we've already figured it all out. Silk, Choco Silk, Choco Silk. Here we go, really quick, and into the fight we go. Oops, I lost my placement. Okay, hold on. Uh, okay. Lorena does a dual attack. Okay, here we go. And that's the ends. That's three right there. Okay, so we're gonna skip here. All right, so let's go. Uh, oops, sorry, my cropping is a bit off. Oh, it's, oh, I see. Uh, Wander Silk is too short. She's too short. So she's actually getting cropped off earlier than the other girls, um, and getting blocked by the by the soul bar. But I think, to be honest, Wander Soak's um, skin or her her chest bra thingy uh, is similar skin color to her. So when it goes transparent, it actually looks kind of convincing. But yes, she's not. Uh, Lorena though, whoa, whoa, whoa! Lorena is in her underwear. Lorena's in her underwear, man. What the frick? Yeah, no. What the heck? Everybody's like, everybody's like, what the heck? Lorena. Yeah, Lorena's in her underwear, or even no underwear. Nani? Nani? Okay, that one, uh, that one is not, not, uh, that was not foreseen. I definitely did not know about that one. Vivian doesn't work. Vivian doesn't work. 
That's the secret behind high morality. Law, law. Okay, so Lorena, Lorena's works definitely works. Uh, I think it's about that frame is probably the best one. Okay, we could keep that one there, and then uh, move that one down. Oops, split it, split it. Uh... Okay, and then uh, I think we're close. We're close to the end, so. So hopefully this was an educational science class. Human behavior, like the mental mental behavior, and uh, also just pervy nature. <laughs> that's, funny. that's funny, man. That's the best E7 content says NDVR. Lol, we got Rin, right? Rin won't work. Rin won't work. She's got too many of those uh, dinglies or danglies. Dinglies? Dinglies? What the, what the frick is dingly? Dingly? Danglies? Those things dangle. Okay, here we go. Now we're gonna go to the S3. Okay, here we go. From here, I'll clip this here and then run it frame by frame. All right, so Celestial Mercedes doesn't work. No, Rin doesn't work. Rose doesn't work either. They're already pretty much half topless. So like the, the transparency is really not helping. It's like a Celestial Mercedes sort of works, I think. The, the thing is like the, the cropping of the lower the the player on the bottom or the hero on the bottom is kind of bad because you don't get to see the full body rose i think we could see a bit of underwear too which is pretty crazy it was her chest piece yeah rin 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 doesn't work um either okay maybe i should put dn on the bottom the last time I put Dian on the bottom, the short girl still got blocked by Dian. So, but maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. I thought Dian on top would be better. Yeah. Maybe Dian had to be on the bottom. But it's okay. It's okay. I mean, we're not going to go back into this just to re-record, just to find out. It's not, That's just way too much work to be pervy, man. This is way too much work. <laughs> this is not... Uh... DN in the back line? No, no, no. The problem is the bottom one, right? The bottom one is getting cropped. As soon as the camera starts zooming in, the bottom gets cropped. So, for example, like the Lorena underwear one, we wouldn't have saw that if Lorena was placed on the bottom. Although Celestial Mercedes is not much to see. She's literally sitting on that book. All right, so here we go. Here's the 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 one example of choosing the, the, the hot boys. Hot boys, right? Someone mentioned Charles before, but uh... <laughs> uh, okay, so we're gonna go. All right, he goes first, and then DN comes next. Okay, here we go. We're just gonna basically see armor disappearing. I don't think you see anything really. Uh, okay, this is maybe for the fan service for the ladies. The ladies. Yeah, crowd just disappears. <laughs> yeah, they're all like, I have to say though, I have to say how the guys disappear is not the same as the girls. Like the guys disappear, like literally, like they they don't have, they don't have a model underneath. I'm kind of surprised. I have to say that is a bit biased. So basically, basically, then what what will happen is that. Uh, this is the deduction. All right, scientific deduction and conclusion is that Smilegate. Well, technically, I mean, it's a waifu collecting game too. Um, technically, they are slightly pervy. I mean, based based on just the designs of the heroes, we can already guess that. But they're pervy to the uh, the amount that they would build and model like most of the girls, where they they actually have stuff underneath the clothes, which is an extra like extra step. So in this case, my understanding would be then says. It says his summer skin actually got like a full rework, whereas like Corinne's was pretty easy. Like literally, like she already she would already be she would already have like a, a full body underneath the the school uniform, and therefore it was easy for them to ad add the additional swimsuit on top. All right, so that's the conclusion. That is the conclusion. I think that's it for this science class, right? I think that was the last clip. Let me just double check here. Um, I think it is, and then I think we just stopped the recording. Yeah, so that was it. Okay, so in summary, in summary, so I have all the clips here. I have all the clips saved up. So in summary, we have one, we have uh two, we have 
hold on one sec i'm just uh, putting these guys in order in a stack so we can uh, we can look at them in terms of uh the summary of the research today with professor jagan professor jagan uh okay let's see here that and then this one all right so yes so here are the clips again luna i think is the most like obvious one um like yeah i think luna is the most obvious one as soon as people saw this it was just like yeah everybody's like poggers uh this one yeah the d yeah this one didn't work robbie sort of worked i think fire robbie does work i remember i recall now someone was pervy enough to say fire robbie was wearing nothing underneath i remember i remember there was a there was a screenshot floating around for sure this one didn't really work uh biking is again is really weird lorena actually worked lorena's actually worked uh rose and uh c merc didn't really work either anyways but those those are the those are the highlights for this one imagine fire <laughs> Imagine fire Robbie the looter. Hey, yo, Brian. Welcome. All right. So in terms of the video recording here, I think that's good. That was a 20 minute episode of the science class, guys. So hopefully this wasn't disappointing. But in terms of like whether or not you're going to pull for DN, uh, this should not. Uh, in all honesty, this should not be one of the considerations. It's a neat little thing, I think, for people who we're kind of salty on DN's rerun or DN's uh, initial release the first time. They're like, oh, she's a really bad healer. So people are just doing like random stuff. But I can't believe that, you know, people actually took the time and actually went frame by frame and say, hey, 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 I just noticed. Like they, they all go like semi-transparent. So it's kind of kind of interesting how that found out. So anyways, I don't, I don't take the credit for finding this out. Again, the wonderful work of Redditors is just pretty crazy. Uh, but regardless... Uh, that that note aside, I will be making a DN feature video when her banner is announced. So you guys will see whether or not you guys really want to pull for her. Anyways, that's it for this episode of Science Class with Jagan. So I'm going to end this for the video recording sake. If you guys have Discord, check out the Discord server. Follow me on Twitter and subscribe to YouTube if you haven't. As always, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys next time. I, I do, I, I am curious about Fire Robbie right now. Like since we're already on the subject, so let me just let me just run it really quick. Just fire Robbie. Uh fire Robbie and DN. So I may I may tack this on at the end of the video as like a not a blooper, but as like bonus content. I think I think it was Robbie. I think Robbie actually worked. But looking at this, I don't see how it works. I don't see how it works. Oh, SS Bologna doesn't work. She has a fan. She has a fan. Okay, so that one's it. Okay, so that's done. Okay, so we're gonna go back. So we got Fire Robbie in. See what this looks like. S3 selected. Oh, wait. Here we go. Let's see what happens. Do, 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 do. Does she go. Okay, I see. I see. Um, hold on, I'm gonna zoom in. They're definitely, yeah, this is definitely more, more, uh, uh, obvious compared to ML Robbie. Yeah, that's definitely, that's definitely, like, more obvious. That's, that's pretty crazy. You can see her tummy. Yeah, I know, right? You could totally see it. So that, that piece of cloth is actually disappearing. So you can literally see her tummy. But that looks, she looks way too skinny, like anorexic. Like anorexic. <laughs> so anyways that's it that's it that's it that's it